going to give you my two cents on the Glock 44 and 22 caliber. Uh, Dad, thanks for bringing it out. We're going to give it a shot today uh, just to show you it's clear. 10 round magazine. Looks like a Glock 19. Feels like a Glock 19. And, uh, but it's a 22. Look at that little barrel. I won't point it at you because that's just weird. Anyways, we're gonna give it a shot and uh, I'll give you my two cents. I got three types of ammo. We'll test fire for accuracy, reliability, feedability, all that good stuff. But you guys can get the specs yourself. But let's have some fun. First shots with the Glock 44 and 22 long rifle. CCI Stingers, 32 grain. Lock and load. We're hot. Accurate. I just knocked my dot off. Accurate, but look at that. Failure to feed. Let's try it again. CCI Stinger, 32 grain. Next one, this is just uh, Winchester bulk ammo, 36 grain, 1250 feet per second. Uh, it's a copper plated hollow point, you know, your standard 555 round box. Lock and load. Let's see how this one performs. Uh, round number three this time we got uh, standard velocity CCI 40 grain just lead solids seem to like those just fine I would not recommend this gun for self-defense however if it does feed reliably and go bang every time. This could leave a mark. Dude, this thing's fun. <laughs> Let's try that with some stingers. Get away from me, bad guy. Pretty badass. I like it. I like it a lot. And it feels just like a Glock. Go figure. <laughs> Alright, thoughts? Uh, I don't know. That's a, it's a Glock. <laughs> I've never been a big fan of the, the, the feel of a Glock. I've, when I, if I bring it up and then sight down, I'm always pointing high. It's just the ergonomics of the gun, not bashing them. I mean, it, it, uh, it's a good shooter. Uh, I mean, uh, it's a full size 22. I mean, recoil is nothing. I mean, it's just bang, bang, bang. It's fun. Fun. That would be, it's a fun gun. If it'll, if it'll feed properly, be a great training gun. Uh, and, uh, just a fun gun to go shoot. So, Cool. That's my thought. We got Danny up to shoot next. That's bulk ammo, dude. That's Winchester. Yeah. The big box. Yeah. It's fun. I like it. We got the man, the myth, the legend. <laughs> the one cuff. <laughs> really? <laughs> Okay, well, these are my final thoughts. 
on the Glock 44 in 22 long rifle. Uh, fun, fun factor, yes, way fun. Feel factor, well, I'm a Glock guy, so I love the way it feels. Uh, I did not buy this gun. Uh, my dad bought it. Uh, I think it's a good gun if you're going to train and you carry a Glock 19 or 17 or whatever size frame that is. Uh, if you're okay with that grip angle and all. Uh, yeah. Would I have bought it? Mm, probably not. If I was going to buy a 22 long rifle, a pistol, I would probably go with a Ruger Mark IV. Uh, more accuracy, uh, reliability. You know, it's going to feed every time. I did have a lot of feeding issues. A lot, meaning every few magazines you'd have at least uh, one stovepipe where it just wouldn't feed. Uh, but other than that, I think it's a, it's a fun gun. If you got the money to spend and want something fun to plank with, I would say go for it. And that's my thoughts on the Glock 44. Y'all have a good one.